story, that proposal to have security guards patrolling Chico streets. This idea was first brought up last night at that public meeting we brought you of the organization Clean and Safe Chico. We'll turn right now to the person who was at that meeting, KRCR News Channel 7's Tyler May. He's live in Chico with both sides of this controversial debate. Tyler? Well, Mark, some people, uh, some people in Chico say they would much rather have more police officers on the street rather than have private security guards. But with Chico PD staffing already low and budget cuts on the horizon, some say there is no other choice. It's an idea that has many taking a hard look. Private security guards patrolling the streets of Chico when police officers can't. I like the idea of police. I like the idea of a trained individual uh, that has the backup of other police easily in the area. Chris Campfield works at Made in Chico. She's seen the jump in alcohol use, violence, and aggressive panhandling in downtown Chico, including people spitting on store windows. Fortunately, so far, they haven't been hers. Yeah, no, it's not a daily issue for us at all. So you guys are lucky then? Oh, yes. Yes. <laughs> I, I guess if it's happening daily to others. The idea of having private security guards walking the streets was kicked around at Wednesday's Clean and Safe Chico meeting. You know, at this point, we're really just exploring what the options are. Katie Simmons and her colleagues on the Clean and Safe Committee would like to see at least 82 Chico police officers on the street. But right now, there are only 67 officers on the force. But with Chico's finances under fire, she says security guards could be the answer. Some kind of combination of private security and public security will probably um, be an end result of these conversations, but we have a lot to explore. Of course, the whole thing is just an idea. We have to determine the feasibility of, um, of you know, blending private and public security and if, you know, if that's even possible, how that would look, what our expectations should be of that. And we tried calling Chico police earlier tonight to kind of see what they thought about this idea, but they say it's too early to have an opinion. Reporting live in Chico tonight, Tyler May, KRCR News Channel 7.